caught wife cheating and was wondering thoughts. Story number one. We've been together for over 21 years now and been married for 17 years. We have three kids together. I've always trusted my wife and I've been confident that when she was getting together with guy friends or co-workers that nothing was going on. She had started going out after work randomly with an ex-boss male who would drive an hour from his place of work to meet her at her place of work or nearby. I was told that they would go for a run and then dinner, drinks, mind you this was probably taking place around to 016-ish. This didn't bother me at all, as I trusted her one day however, I got an anonymous message on Facebook created from a fake account that basically was stating that they've seen my wife with another guy several times and didn't know how to approach me about it but wanted to alert me to it. They made mention about seeing them on trails and at a restaurant and made comments about how they had thought about going to my sister. I somehow convinced myself that this message was a fake and from a bot per se. Soon after I did talk with my wife about how this guy must have other motives if he's driving an hour after work to run for miles with her and avoiding going home to be with his own wife and kids which were still an hour from where they were running. My wife told me that she squashed this connection after our conversation. Fast forward to 2020, my wife was our with a different ex-boss again, male. When she comes home, she tells me about this night and how he was connecting with a different girl at the bar and ended up doing some things with this girl at the end of the night and sending some pics to my wife. Her telling me, this got me to start looking at her messages. Whenever she would be away from her phone, she had always told me that she deleted old text messages, which is another red flag, so the messages that I would look at would always be a bit fragmented. Anyways, this guy would send my wife pics and videos of him having sex with other girls, so this kept me on high alert and constantly wanting to look at her messages. One morning during winter of 2021, we were away on a family vacation. I found myself glancing at my wife's phone while she was away from it. I caught a texting conversation between her and a female friend that spoke of a guy that my wife was seeing. The feeling that came over me was unexplainable. I had convinced myself that nothing was going on with things in the past, but now reality was setting in. As I continued to catch fragments of conversations, I learned that my wife was going out with this girlfriend and they would then meet up with some guys later in the night to make matters worse. The guy that my wife was connecting with was a friend of hers in town. I start to see that her and this guy are using other apps to communicate, so I try and monitor those conversations, but she is fairly quick to delete these messages. I would even see her texting him while laying next to me in bed while she probably thought I was sleeping. I would see their good morning messages as well. It became a lot to make matters worse. We were getting work done in our house and I came to find out that my wife also had conversations in these other apps with the contractor as she either was or was trying to get together with him. While all of this is going on and again, I'm catching fragments of conversations due to the deleting that's going on. I also caught a text from what was her current boss then and he makes mention of hooking up together. The more I write this out, the more I'm feeling extremely stupid and like a chump. Anyways, with all of this going on, I reach out to the guy in town's wife via text as I wanted to get her on my side and make her aware this backfired on me as she thought that my text to her was a fake and showed her husband he then reached out to my wife who then came driving home crying to me. We then discussed some of what I mentioned here. I told her to break things off with these guys and she has told me that she did. During the few months of me trying to find out what was going on while watching her texts when I could, I went from being a very confident and happy male to being someone who can't get this stuff out of his head and can't even explain the way I feel about all of this. My wife and I have had a couple of conversations over the past couple of years since this has all transpired to help with what goes on in my head, but it is still very tough on me. It is 2023 and two years since this all came to a head. I never thought to reach out to this community beforehand, but I am wondering what people might tell me. What advice would you give to me in trying to work through this and save our family? Story number two. 
So I think first I need to give more of a backstory. So a couple of months ago, I was using my husband's laptop and I was sending pictures from phone to his laptop to he has a MacBook. So all his pictures on his phone are also in his laptop. So while I was looking for the pictures, I happened to find a video of him having sex with one of the neighbors in our old apartment. Personally, I think that was all the evidence I needed. However, I know that there is always more. So I took some time to gather all the evidence I needed, pictures, text messages, phone logs, everything. After I confronted him, he proceeded to blame me. He said he was not attracted to me as I had put on weight and he said he wanted a divorce. I didn't want one, so I begged it's crazy even though he was hurting me. I didn't want to lose my marriage. So any time I would feel depressed and sad and told him about it, he would threaten me with divorce, so I've spent the past couple of months walking on eggshells. I would cry by myself and put on a brave face in front of everyone. So I decided to start working on myself. I started working out. I started meditation. I focused on my career and I got a promotion at work. I still putting money and out joint account and start saving my money elsewhere. I have also moved my share of the savings and used a little extra for a flight ticket. Yesterday he said to me, he didn't want to be married, he was not expecting me to say okay. I've never seen him so quiet, I made sure to tell him exactly how I felt and I also informed him that after the divorce he would never see or speak to me again, I think in that moment he realized the whole time he has always needed me more than I need him. I do everything for this man, he can't even put on the washing machine. I do everything for this man and hold down a full-time time job and contribute to half the bills. He then all of a sudden changed his tune, saying he loves me, he can't be with anyone else, that's crazy to me. After he has been attempting to divorce me, I finally agreed and all of a sudden. He doesn't want a divorce, I told him we could work it out of, he agreed for us to go to counseling, and of course he agreed. But I'm not interested in this marriage anymore and I had the best sleep of my life last night, knowing that on Monday, I will be on a flight to Singapore with my share of our joint, saving while he is receiving divorce papers, I guess I can say checkmate.